Buenos, 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 buenos noches to my lovely people. It's pretty dark outside, but it is evening. It's about 6 p.m. in Puerto Viejo, Costa Rica. And I'm shooting an awesome video this evening. This video is best restaurants of Puerto Viejo. I'm excited to be going on this journey with you guys and be taking you guys to the best restaurants. So when you guys come to Puerto Viejo, you know where to go. Stay tuned as we go. Costa Rica pura vida. Vibes on a journey. Pura vida, right? Costa Rica and Costa Rica, Costa Rica to the world. Pura vida. So you guys, very first restaurant we're going to this evening is a place called Tasty Waves Cantina. So a lot of the locals and tourists in Puerto Viejo actually recommend this place. Not only for the awesome food, but for the ambiance and the vibes. And today's Tuesday, and they told me that it's Taco Tuesday today. So you know, I love my tacos. So, so let's go to the very first restaurant and let's get some good food. I'm from the Tida. Oh. Hey. I just got in this place. It seems really nice so far. Good ambiance. They got some music playing. It's a full place. All the tables are already full and reserved. It's Taco Tuesdays, right? Hola. Hey. How are you, my brother? Cool. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. What's your name? My name is Luis, but the people is calling me Tegue. Nice to meet you, Tegue. Hey. Man, pura vida. Remix. What I'm saying. Call me Mr. Doctor. My belly is rumbling. I can't wait for these tacos. I didn't want to show you guys, but they gave me a little sombrero today. So I just found out today is Cinco de Mayo. So to all those people celebrating Cinco de Mayo, happy celebration to you guys. Food is on its way, and the owner is coming to present it to me. Awesome. Let's get it. Hello there. Hey, how you doing, man? Good. Nice to meet you. Fish taco. Fish taco. Fish taco. Golden pretty out. Perfect. The beer of Costa Rica. Thank you so much. I'm going to definitely enjoy this meal. Thank you. I will. Else At this moment, I'm gonna try this meal and then I'm gonna come talk to you in a bit. Let's get it. Let's get it. Sink away. Look at the colors. Look at the texture. Oh man, it's. I'm already tasting it and I'm just looking at it. So I, they surprised me with. I should have asked them, but I think this is shrimp tacos and this is the fish tacos. Fantastic. I'm a seafood fanatic, so this is how we're gonna enjoy it. Let's check it out. Let's check out the texture, the look of it. Oh man, the shine and how like look, just feel how look how thick it is. It's a real taco right here. Amazing, guys. This is perfect. The shrimp is perfect. There's a lot, of, the texture is great, the seasoning of the shrimp is great. So this is the Baja fish taco. I'm gonna take my first bite. It's a great place, you guys. Definitely come on and check it out. Thank you very much. That was honestly one of the best tacos I had in Puerto Rica, Costa Rica. You're welcome. I'm going to say your name. I know you. Yes, you do know me. Yes, you got it. Henny's World. Hey, you got it. And can I ask you two questions, right there? Yeah, of course. Uh, how long has the restaurant been around? Uh, it'll be 10 years in September. That's amazing. 10 yeah. years, you guys. We're going for it. We're going to make it through this c shit. We are going to make it. that 10 year reunion. Look at that. And during COVID. Stopping us. And during COVID. 
Look yeah. at the ambiance in the place. We gotta give people something to do, man. We need a little bit of normalcy in our lives. Yeah. We're being respectful. We're keeping our distance. But you know, your bubble, you come enjoy it with your bubble. You know, so. You got it, my brother. And one more last question yeah. I want to ask you: What makes this restaurant such a very popular restaurant for the tourists and locals in Costa Rica, Puerto Viejo? Uh, I'm gonna say number one. We've always had the best staff around by, by far. Uh, you know, we've prided ourselves on our longevity, uh, low turnover rates, man. Some of my cooks, seven years, six years, bartenders, five years. And number two, uh, best guests in the world, man. Awesome. Something about, uh, we just always manage to get the best of the best. So we're smiling every day. It's, it's never work if you're having fun. Working on the wood and bugs. Never gotta worry about locking the dog. Hey. Bomb. And it's daytime, you guys. You know, just like that. It was from dark to night. From night to daytime. So right now we're going to our next restaurant. So just to let you guys know something about Porto Viejo, Porto Viejo is very is, is the Caribbean coast, and this is a city, uh, this and as well Limon, uh, that it takes pride in their Caribbean cuisines. So right now we're about to be going to a Caribbean um, Caribbean restaurant. We're gonna try the Caribbean local dishes here. So I was recommended by many of the tourists and locals about this place called Tamara, and let's check it out. Ah, yes, hermano. All right, guys, let's go check it out. Thank you very much. Let's get it, guys. And you guys are in for a treat because I'm going to be showing you guys Caribbean food, Jamaican styled, Costa Rican, kind of like a uh, 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 migrationology, but more Caribbean. Oh man, here it comes. Look at that. Typical. That's why we are famous. Ginger, coconut milk are the secrets. Wow. What's the sauce? Can I ask you what's the sauce on this? Sauce. Ginger, coconut milk, a little bit of sugar. Amazing. That's why it's like that. Yeah. Because they have Jamaica seeds. Know them? Yeah. That's the secret. But it's good. Thank you so much. As you guys can see, it looks like jerk chicken right now. But it is a mixture of Costa Rican Caribbean style. The chicken is marinated. Uh, the sauce is seasoned right. The chicken is tender, as you guys can see. We got the plantinos. We got the salad. If you guys are ever coming to Puerto Viejo and you're looking for this place, Tamara, it's right in the center of Puerto Viejo. But let's continue eating. Let's try this out. Look at that, look at that sauce. I'm just gonna take the rice right now, just try that out. Woo! You can taste the richness of coconut, the seasoning. Rice and beans, let's try the chicken out. Very tender chicken. Ooh, let's take the chicken by itself. Amazing, you guys. Splendid. Welcome to Tamara, Puerto Viejo, Costa Rica. That was a really great meal. And now you guys know Tamara, really great restaurant. Caribbean style, typical Costa Rican dishes. Very great for their food. Definitely come check it out. I will be taking you guys to only the best Caribbean restaurants and all of the best restaurants in Puerto Viejo. Let's go on to the next journey. Let's go. All right guys, so before we go to the next restaurant, I wanted to bring you guys to this place. It's not a restaurant, but it is a very popular coffee shop in Puerto Viejo. What makes this coffee shop so popular is that everything is organic based. Um, they take real pride in their cacao chocolates here. Hey, what's up, you guys? It's, uh, Woo! You enjoying that? What, do you, what did you get? Uh, we got the vegan gluten-free banana chocolate with the brownie here that's uh I've so we're making it like a double so we're mixing the two and then having a mochaccino with that oh man we have all salute. the best chocolate. salute 
We got all the best chocolate goodies. goodies. We got all the best chocolates here. My chocolate goodies. goodies. We got the chai latte. Wow. Check this out. Let's check it out. About 12 years ago, we realized that there's uh, all kinds of cacao growing here. Yeah. And then you make chocolate with cacao. Yeah. I started experimenting. I was roasting coffee already, so I started to roast cacao beans yeah. in my coffee roaster. Yeah. And uh, now, years later, we have this whole line of chocolates made right here in Puerto Viejo. Wow. And so, yeah. what, let me understand. These are cacao chocolates that you've made with different types of coffee beans. Different, different types of cacao beans, actually. Wow. So they're very popular. But we started making the chocolate, and we were sort of blowing everybody's minds. Hey, you can't make chocolate. It's too hot and humid. And, and I was like, what do you mean? There's, you know, people have invented, like, air conditioners and refrigerators <laughs> and stuff. Yeah. So I was like, all right, forget about that. And started trying to make chocolate. Yeah. We won awards, international awards. We put a ice cube of coffee in every uh, cold drink, so that's special. Absolutely. In every hot drink, you get a little gift of a piece of chocolate with your, with your coffee. So. Amazing. Right, Thank right. you so much. We'll see you soon. For sure. All right. Hell yeah. <laughs> all right. Ciao. All right. Amazing spot, you guys. I just got to the next restaurant. This place is called Lydia's Place. And just a little bit about this restaurant. This restaurant is said to be, from all the locals that I've talked to in this city, to be one of the number one spots for Caribbean food. This is a restaurant you cannot miss when you come to Puerto Viejo. So let's go in and check it out. Let's go. Perfecto. Hola. How are you, buddy? How are you? Good. Nice to meet you. Welcome. Thank you. Your food is amazing. Real Caribbean Jamaican uh, food. This is like one of the first Caribbean um, restaurants here in Puerto Viejo, one of the oldest ones. But this wow. is our brown stew chicken in Caribbean style. Amazing. And we have this traditional drink, the here in Limon. We yeah. call it Yer. Yeah. Yeah. Ginger, sugar, and lime. I don't know if you want to know the other name. What is the other name? It has two names. But the other one is a little bit scary. Yeah? Yeah. It's called yeah. Bullfrog Water. Bullfrog Water. I want this apple. But it's amazing. It's a good yeah. energy, good source of stuff. Yeah. All natural. It's really need. refreshing. Look at that, you guys. <sighs> amazing. Thank you so much, brother. Welcome. And this is the Caribbean food. Ginger. Oh, I love ginger and a good drink. Try it out. Very good. Woo. Just look at that. Chicken stew, type of jerk type of sauce, but more stew based. You got the rice and pinto. You got the lettuce with all the, all the fine things in it. You got the plantino. Perfecto, and a beautiful drink. This is one of the most famous drinks here. Very nice, very great. Guys. Amazing food. Thank you so much. Welcome. Welcome, and to the world. What do you want to say to the world? One thing. Hey, you gotta come to Lydia's place. You know, this is the place to eat the green Caribbean. Amazing. <laughs> Nice to meet you. Lydia, of course. Yeah, I'm Lydia. Nice to meet you, Lydia. How long has this restaurant been open for? We have it for 25 years. Wow. 25 years, you guys. I don't love There's no place. Guys, you guys know that's Lydia's place. Fantastic spot. Fantastic food. Made with love. So the reason why they're so great and so popular is because everything is done with love. So right now it's pretty dark, but I want to go to the next restaurant. So you know what? I'm gonna change the light now. That's more like it. Put the light back on. Let's talk about this next place that I'm gonna be going to. Uh, it's not a restaurant, but it is a bakery place. I tell you guys, this is the best bakery place in Puerto Viejo. This one, I have been going here ever since I've came here. When I tell you, it is such fantastic. It is fantastic, delicious. Yo, 
Um, it's called Degustibus. And let's check it out. Let's go inside and check out this place. <laughs> Good, my friend. So, uh, he already knows me. I come here all the time to get my grapey stuff. Really great stuff. So they have uh, cold. So can you tell me about right here what's going on? Hermano? Ah, this is the pastries. Have the cream puff. Okay. With chocolate cream. Perfecto. Fresh fruits. Nice. The famous cannoli. Amazing. And uh, here you find the one with the Nutella. We're Italian. We use a lot of Nutella, you know? Hey, yes. That's beautiful. Uh, you guys Donuts, see that? Filled with the pastry cream and chocolate cream. Yeah. Today I have this special donut. It's like, you know, two kilo of donut. Yeah, perfect. You guys, and everything is made the same day, yeah. right? Fantastic. Just yeah. look at it, guys. We made everything. Amazing, amazing. The dough, amazing. the cream, the pizza, amazing. everything. They even have, you guys, they even have pizza here. So if you don't want a sweet option, you can get a, uh, a pizza option. And the pizza is fantastic. So this is Italian inspired, Italian owned. So you're gonna get uh, something very similar to the Italian way of bakery style. So it's really nice. They got their pizzas. Uh, <laughs> the face is a little bit uh, blurry, but really great. You got veggie, salami, margarita, cheese, calzone. And then you got right here, uh, just the, the breads, if you need breads. And it's all fresh from the same day. All right, you guys, fantastico. Yes. Really great. But I recommend one of this. <laughs> All right. You know what? what, what I'm gonna cappuccino. All right. Let's get up. So, uh, these guys have so many different options to have. So, you should, as you guys seen, you've seen the pastries, you've seen the cold pastries, you've seen the things that's made the same day of the croissants. Um, so, bakery, you got pizza, you got bread right there. Then they got, you know, they specialize in their coffees. They have cappuccinos, they have mochiatos, they have espressos. And then they have ice cream, so if you want something nice like that. So you kind of have everything you need. It's a great place to start your day, great place to just, you know, come and get a little breakfast, or come get a nice coffee, cappuccino. And you know what, this is a fantastic place. My favorite bakery place in Puerto Viedo. This is the cappuccino. Fantastic. And what is this uh, donut called? This is a bombolone. The Italian word is bombolone. Amazing. Perfecto. All right. Perfecto. You know what? Let's try the donut first. Wow. Wow. Tender. The dough is very tender. Rich. I didn't get the filling part yet. Let me take another bite. Look at that. Let's look at that. Just made right now. I can still feel the warmth in the donut. Oh man. Cheers. So you guys, if you want bakery spot, come out here to Degusta Bus Bakery. If I did not pronounce it right, you guys will have it. Let's go on to the next restaurant. Really cool thing about this restaurant is right in front of the Playa Coplas Beach. And this beach, Playa Coplas, is one of the best beaches for surfing. So if you're a surfer and you want to surf it up and then get a nice meal, so Caribe is right in front of it, right there, inside. Hola. How are you doing? Hola. Yes, indeed. Uh, I'm ex I heard. Thank you so much. I'm excited. I heard uh, really great things about this restaurant. And I'm excited to try this food out. Oh man. This is the 
white rice, salad, and some fries. Enjoy it, man. Oh, man. You got shrimps, broccoli, cauliflower, onions, uh, sweet peppers, uh, carrots. Uh, I don't know how you call the green stuff in English. Uh, like Vinicas, you know. Wow, perfecto. It smells so good. Just look at that. Look at the seasoning. The smell is empowering. Shrimp, the seasoning, the sauce, the coconut, the tide of everything. Wow, look at that. Fantastic. This is healing food, you guys. Look at that. Look at the colors. All oh, the colors. Thank you. Fantastico. Speaking to the owner right now. Hola. And the lovely lady from the start of this beautiful restaurant is the owner of this beautiful establishment. Thank you so much. The food is really great. Can I ask you two questions about this place? Um, how long has this restaurant been open for? Uh, five years. Five years? Yeah. Ooh, and five years is it's doing good. Yeah, I Great. try. <laughs> I'm happy, I'm happy. And another last question. What makes this restaurant so popular and so well known from the locals and the tourists in uh, Costa Rica, Puerto Viejo? Um, I think so is because uh, I try to make everything with love. You know? Yes. So when I cook, I cook um, every day. So I try Beautiful. to make um, with love. So I don't have a difference for local or tourists. I try everything. Same. Same. So I, I think so. This is the yeah. amazing. That meal was so good, <laughs> Thank you. guys. It's more popular. Huh? It's more popular. Yeah. Thank you so much. You I appreciate it. Have a beautiful day. It's same for you. And you too, my dear. Ciao. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Fantastic place, guys. Definitely check out Sol Caribe. Actually, it's one of my favorite Caribbean places. Thank you so much, you guys. All right, man. Pura vida. Pura vida. Pura vida. Oh man, let's go. Oh man, what is that? We have some mackerel and some fish. Mackerel fish? Yes, man, this is fish from Indonesia, so fresh fish. Fresh, fresh, catch yesterday, you know? Some real mackerel and coconut milk, you know? We have some lovely brownies for you know, for sweet up, you know, some posture and dessert, you know? Bless it. Not these are not less. <laughs> I love it, brother. Yeah, so Aki and Saltfish, you know? Yeah. Aki and Saltfish. Wow. That's why you guys have to be here right now. Woo. Bless it. This is amazing. He has to tell you, I can't tell you nothing. Right now. I'm gonna just stick a tease of juices, you know? We have the MBO. What's made of the cane sugar, ginger, lemonade, and we and we do have right now the passion fruit. Sometimes we have the sorrel as well. But today we have these two choices. You know? Amazing. That's amazing. Man. Highly respect this man, Christian. You know he comes here every weekend. Very popular in the in the city. Everybody knows his food. Really great tasting. Real Caribbean style food. Everything is made from his own hands. And you guys gotta come and check it out. So this is me ending off my video of best restaurants of Puerto Viejo. And you know what, stay tuned for the next episode. Peace and love.